Arctroopers are widely known to Clone Wars fans as the best of the Grand Army of the Republic. The first Fett clones produced by the Kaminoans and the most independent. But what fewer people know is that there were actually two classes of Arcs. More well-known commandos like Fordo and Alpha were Alpha class Arc Troopers. But there was another class too, which was bred first. These clones were the Null class Arc Troopers and they have perhaps the most complex story of any clone unit in the galaxy. The Nulls were a line of prototype clones and were essentially tests for the Kaminoans' genetic modification methods. Twelve were produced, but half of these died during the incubation period, leaving only six survivors. The Kaminoans originally sought to terminate these clones after discovering their insubordinate tendencies, but the objections of Cal Skorata saved them, and they went on to be personally trained by him as an elite force. The six that survived were named Ordo, Comruk, Muriel, Aiden, Prudai, and Jang. The Nulls were trained by Cal Skorata personally and to an extreme level. They were kept apart from the other clones who only saw them when they were sabotaging or stealing equipment. Skorata trained the clones through an unforgiving array of tests which shaped them into Mandalorian quality warriors and also gave them a near complete resistance to torture. Skorata and the Nulls grew close to each other over the course of the commando's training. When the Clone Wars broke out, the Nulls were among the special commando units sent to Genosis to participate in the battle. During combat, they showed the same uncommandable traits that the Kaminoans had noticed before, and they were once more scheduled to be euthanized. In protest, the Nulls seized the controls of the Arca barracks on Kamino and barricaded themselves within, holding off eight teams of clone commandos in an armed siege. The situation only diffused when Skorata convinced them to stand down on the condition that they would not be terminated. After this, the Nulls served in a variety of roles throughout the war. They served in frontline combat, in counter-terrorist missions, and even in sabotage missions against the Confederacy. Two of their number even tracked General Grievous during the war and discovered that he was hiding on Utapau in the war's final days. But at one point, the Nulls began to grow dissatisfied with their lives. And after Kaminoan scientist Ko Sai disappeared, they became dead set on finding her to reverse the accelerated aging process they had been engineered with. After the Clone Wars ended, Cal Skorata adopted the Nulls, making them officially members of the Skorata clan and bringing them to live with him on Mandalore. They did so for the most part in peace, as far as one can do on a world such as Mandalore, while they pursued ways to cure their accelerated aging, as we discussed in an earlier video on the Confederacy's Dr. Ovalot Quail Uthan. One way or another, they were ultimately successful, although exactly how is unknown. The Nulls are a creation of Karen Travis, the author of the Republic Commando series and a Mandalorian enthusiast. If you want to see more from her works on this channel or have any thoughts, feel free to post them in the comments section below. And as always guys, thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.